Is porn addictive? That's an interesting question. People certainly love to watch it, but are they addicted in the same way that you can be addicted to smoking or alcohol? Well, let me answer that question with another question. How do you define addiction? Well, the first thing that you should think about is that mental health professionals agree that pornography is not considered an addiction. That's to say that if someone looks at porn, their brains actually show the reverse effect of what an addiction would normally do. Instead of showing high rates of brain activity, as you would if you were, say, on cocaine, the reverse actually occurs. So in a physiological sense, porn doesn't cause addiction the way cigarettes and opioids do. But that's just how health professionals define an addiction, by its physiological effects. But that fact doesn't mean that porn addiction doesn't behave like other addictions in different ways. For example, according to the National Institute on Drug Abuse, an addiction is a chronic relapsing brain disease that is characterized by compulsive drug seeking and use despite harmful consequences. So basically what that means is to be an addiction, it has to have a compulsive need and a harmful effect. So do people have a compulsive need for porn? And does that compulsive need end in harmful effects? Well, we'll start with compulsive need. The drives that cause people to want to watch porn are the same ones that fuel repopulation of a species. In other words, we are evolutionarily programmed to have sex drives. It's said that the first thing that was ever printed on Gutenberg's printing press was the Bible, and the second was porn. So there's obviously some human compulsion to consume porn, but does that necessarily correlate to a compulsion? The closest related compulsion to a porn addiction that I can think of is eating, in that it's necessary for the species to survive, but too much can be harmful and counterproductive. So if one can have a food addiction, is it so hard to believe that you could also have a porn addiction? And what about harmful effects? Well, a study from 2014 published in the JAMA Psychiatry linked men who watch porn to decreases in grey matter, a major part of the brain. The correlation was really significant, but the researchers weren't sure if it was the porn that had caused the change in the brain or if the brain was already like that which is what made them want porn. So if compulsion plus harm makes an addiction, there's not any particular hard evidence that demonstrates a negative health consequence of watching pornography. So if it's compulsion plus harm that makes an addiction, is porn then addictive? Well, I guess it's up to you. If your porn habit is damaging your relationship, affecting you psychologically, and if all that constant action is giving you RSI, then yes, you've got what could be clinically described as an addiction to porn. But for the most part, watching porn doesn't have have any proven negative physical effects. So in the absence of further research, bank on my friends. Hi everyone, I'm Jade Lovell, resident science nerd on the Young Turks Network. You're watching SciQ and we know you don't want to miss an episode, so please click the subscribe button down below.